If you ever have shitty days, I got something for you. Because I want to share something that's profound that I experienced recently while I was on my morning run. And it's really a simple concept, but it holds what I believe is the key to finding balance and really unlocking the power of our daily routines. So we all know that life has its ups and downs. Days that we don't feel like doing something, days that we feel really motivated to do something. And we all have the days that are far from perfect. And it's easy to feel like hitting the snooze button on life itself on those days. But here's the thing. These challenging days are really your training ground. They're where your mental strength is being forged. And these days are what I've realized make me so resilient. And I believe the same can be for you. And so on those challenging days, it might feel like the universe is really against you. But in reality, these days are shaping you. They're preparing you for the battles that are ahead. They're the crucible where your character is tested and refined. Now let's talk about the other 70% or the maintenance days. These are the days where you're following your routines, you're checking off your to-do list, and these are the days where you just keep the wheels going. You're keeping your momentum. They might not feel like, you know, that victory lap, but these are the glue that are really holding everything together. And the maintenance days are what I've realized are the backbone of my life. These are the days when I'm putting in the work and I'm doing it usually without much celebration. But these are crucial for our long-term success because they're the steady beat in the rhythm of our lives. And then there's the glorious 15%. These are the days when everything aligns and it seems like everything in my day is really effortless. This is when I feel like I'm in the flow. And this is the days that I'm smiling and everything just seems to fall into place. That is the magic of these days. These are the days that we're always looking for. But remember, it's only 15% of the time. And these flow days are really what I like to think of as a reward for your persistence and for the hard work that I've been putting in. They're a glimpse of what life can be when everything just clicks. And they're a reminder, what I believe from the universe, that it has moments of pure serendipity. And here's the beauty of all of this, is that you actually need every single one of those days, the challenging days, the maintenance days, and the glorious days, to find a balance and to really have appreciation for them all. Because you can't fully savor the sweet without tasting a little bit of bitter, right? So the next time that you're having a challenging day, take a moment to identify it, label it, identify, is this a challenging day? Is this a routine day? Or is this one of the glorious days? Because by embracing it, you're going to be shaping your resilience. Then on your maintenance days, find gratitude in your consistency and your ability to keep moving forward, to continue to try, to continue to build. And when you get to that glorious 15% of flow arrives, cherish it. Oh my gosh, if I could go back and tell myself anytime I've had these flow days to cherish it, because this is a gift. This isn't something that you're going to get every single day. So when they come around, make sure you're taking time to cherish it. Because each day is going to pass. The amazing glorious days is going to come, it's going to go. Like I said, it's 15% of the time you'll be experiencing that. And if you do the math, that's one day every seven weeks. That's one day every seven weeks that you're in a challenging phase. And that's five days of the seven that you're going to be in the maintenance, the routine, just going through stuff. So I want you to find a way to embrace them all the challenging, the routine, the amazing, because they're all part of life's intricate tapestry. And you can't fully appreciate the light without a touch of darkness. So my friends, here's to embracing 
all the flavors of life, all the days that you're experiencing. And remember that a different day is literally right around the corner. It's waiting for you in the next 24 hours. And it's your opportunity to seize the day for what it is. And if you're having a terrible day, it's your reminder that this too shall soon pass. So cheers to you. Cheers to change. Until next time, my friends, have an amazing day. And I hope to see you on your next flow day.